Ladies and gentlemen, the New England Association of Amusement Parks and Attractions is proud to induct friend and colleague Justine Brewer of Southwick Zoo into the Niapa Hall of Fame. My name is Justine Brewer and I'm president of Southwick Wild Animal Farm Inc. doing business at Southwick's Zoo in Menden, Massachusetts. Born in Menden, Justine Adrian Southwick was the firstborn child of Justin and Clarice Southwick. During Justine's childhood, she spent much of her time helping out on her family's 1803 farm, including milking cows before going to school. My dad started the zoo. I was born and brought up on this property. It dates back to 1803. And I can remember my mom saying that actually our ancestors Lawrence and Cassandra Southwick came over on the second trip of the Mayflower. So I feel like my roots are very, very deep in the Blackstone Valley. This quaint family farm grew into a working dairy farm before it began to focus on unusual birds in 1952. So I was born and brought up on the farm and my dad always had fancy poultry. He used to go on the rail cars all over, out to the Midwest and up into New York State for the fairs and he had fancy birds and had trophies and so he was very, very big into any kind of bird and from the poultry, which I am sure he had every single kind there ever was. And I was really more of a farm girl with the cows and the horses. I wasn't too pleased with the chickens most of the time. I liked the cows and the horses and I had my own 4-H project with an Ashia heifer and all that sort of thing. In order to raise funds to maintain the Southwick's position as a leader in the field of migratory waterfowl, the farm expanded to include exotic animals. Justine, along with her parents and siblings, Sandra and Daniel, constructed enclosures to house the new residents of what was now becoming fondly referred to as the Southwick Animal Farm. Once this transition started and the word got around that there were these unusual animals, then people started to come. So at that point, he put out a donation box and people would leave donations. Justine and her husband, Robert Brewer, were married and started a family. It was soon apparent that they were needed more than ever to assist in the family's rapidly expanding animal farm. Sixty-three, actually, my husband and I and our five children went down to help my dad because my brother was in the hospital. And it ended up that we ended up staying there. Justine and Robert, along with their then four children, David, Peter, Betsy, and Robert, moved back into Justine's childhood home where they welcomed their fifth child, Cindy. Justine graduated from Becker College in Worcester, Massachusetts with a medical secretary degree. Well, actually, my training was medical secretary. That's what I thought it was going to be, but I ended up getting married and having five children. And uh, my husband had a banking uh, background, so he was really kind of the businessman of the group. With Robert's banking background and Justine's passion for the care and curation of birds and animals, the farm was developing into a well-respected zoological park. There are very, very few private zoos. Anheuser-Busch was the one that would come to mind first. Uh, but there are very, very few. It's a labor of love, there's no doubt about it. Justine is committed and devoted to preserving her heritage and her family's legacy through the involvement with numerous organizations. She is a member of six Chambers of Commerce, the Outdoor Amusement Business Association, the New England Association of Amusement Parks and Attractions, the National Trust for Historic Preservation, the Menden Historical Society, and the Central Massachusetts Conventions and Visitors Bureau. And I love, I love the business. She is also firmly committed to assist her community through the Chestnut Street Meeting House, the Millville Women's Club, and the Worcester Women's History Project. Additionally, Justine is a corporator for the Milford Regional Hospital, a trustee of the First Uxbridge Congregational Church, and the founder of the Daniels Farmstead Foundation. Justine has the honor of being a recipient of a Woman of Distinction Award, the Daughter of the American Revolution Award, and the Butch Moore You Touched Upon My Life Award. 
you know, I always said you should do what you love to do, and I've always told my kids that. Justine's family is and has always been the grounding force of her determination and devotion. Justine is proud of all of her children, grandchildren, and great-grandchildren. Under the involvement and direction of Justine Southwick Brewer, Southwick Zoo remains the largest zoo in New England with over 850 animals on 200 acres of prime real estate. Ladies and gentlemen, please join us in celebrating as the New England Association of Amusement Parks and Attractions inducts Justine Brewer into the Neapa Hall of Fame.